What attracted you to, to play with the band tonight? Uh, Phil Spalding, an old friend, invited me to play on their new album. When I went down south to do the album with them, and, and uh, as soon as I uh, got with the guys in the band, I realized that they were a real set of musicians, like bands I used to be in, Free and Crawler, and you know, organic musicians. And uh, I haven't had that experience in quite a while because of the digital age. And uh, we got on like a house on fire because me being a musician and their musicians, Jay's great on the guitar, Rob writes great songs and he sings fantastic. Sean is almost like a, a, a Liverpudlian sort of Ringo clone, you know what I mean? So laid back. And, uh, and Matt's great on the bass, solid as a rock. Uh, that reminds me of a bit of Free, uh, the way Andy Fraser used to play. And when I did the overdub pianos and organs and things, I knew that I was in an environment that would, was like what I lost when, I, uh, when, I, when Free split and then when my band Crawler split and uh, when I joined The Who. Uh, so because then I entered a world of uh, uh, musical geniuses like Pete Townsend where they know what they want and it's less of a band creative situation than it is uh, uh, giving Pete exactly what he wants and what he hears in his head and, and to the structure that he has. But with uh, bands prior to that and with uh, Night Parade, it's, it's, a, it's a total freedom creative spot where you, you come up with your own ideas and make them fit the band. And to me, that was like a fresh of breath air, to be honest, to remind me of the days when I first came to England. Uh, the day I arrived in England in 1971, I went straight in the studio with uh, Kossoff Kirk Tetsu Rabbit, which was an offshoot of Free. That turned into Free Heartbreaker. I was working with Johnny Nash at the same time, and I can see clearly now. And then it those two rolled into me becoming London's main keyboard player for sessions. And so I was working with a lot of organic music. And uh, be because the Who are so structured, that kind of dissipated a bit, and working with Rob and the guys, it's just made me almost feel back in the, like I'm back in the 70s, and, and free to create, free to use my brain musically, and to actually impress the guys in the band with my musicianship like they do me. So I've thoroughly loved it, and I do plan to do more with them. If it uh, if it if it's what they want to do, and if all things work out, I'm sure yeah. you will, John. That was well, that would be nice. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks for your support. We'll see you again. We'll be night, Thank you, John. You're a good one, mate.